Hi Sagittarius, welcome to your reading. If you are new here and don't want to miss the daily tarot readings, you can subscribe now by clicking the red button below this video. This is a general love reading for the second week of December. So it may or may not resonate with all of you because it is a general love reading. At the end of this video, if you are interested, I will also record an extended to know more specific details on their feelings and intentions for you this moment. Now let's start with your reading. And uh, I will start with what happened in the past and why it all happened. Then, at the end of this reading, there are possible actions towards you, if any. Let's shuffle four times. So let's see. Let's see, starting with the, what happened in the past and why it all happened. The connection was not quite honest and straightforward, so someone was playing mind games there. Had a big ego. Wanted to win every uh, fight or argument. Maybe you gave this person another chance, but still it was the same. The same conflicts and arguments. So someone may have asked for another chance in the past, and maybe you gave it, uh, you gave this person another chance, or you thought that it was not worth it because it was. Uh, the same problematic uh, situation. Now, let's see about the current energies. I think that uh, there's no talking or communication between both of you. There's a focus being on work, on career. I think your focus is now on your work, on your job or hobby. Regarding connections, I, I think you want stability now. You want a serious relationship. What is affecting you in your subconscious that you may not be aware of is the fact that you feel sometimes alone. Alone without that connection. Feeling left out in the cold. Feeling uh, like being ghosted. How you view the situation? Ace of Swords in the reverse. You may think they lied to you. They were not honest. And you don't expect any communication anytime soon. Now, the overall energy, I think you are becoming more mature now in love and uh, viewing things in a different light, with a different, with different uh, perspective. I think you want to take charge of this whole situation and make something happen, maybe find a better new partner or realizing that uh, sometimes it is our responsibility that we are in a connection that is not working. And if we tolerate a connection like that to work and we get the same results after we give this person chances after chances, maybe we did something wrong. Maybe we shouldn't have been that uh, long in a connection like that. So different perspectives, uh, different thoughts that you may be having and all of that is regarding you being more mature now in love, not uh, uh, not quite. It is not uh, very easy to fool you now in love. That's what I think. It is not very easy to fool you now in love because you have experienced so much. These were challenges, but also lessons. You hope for a connection to come your way, but uh, you don't want to rush it. Uh, you want something serious now. And your focus is a passionate connection and uh, a connection that has desire, that has attraction. You don't want a boring uh, uh, connection. I think mostly you want a, a new fiery connection. A connection that has lots of passion. Now let's see about what is happening with this person. They have feelings for you. We are talking about the person from the past. 
but they are not doing anything. They are just there with their thoughts and feelings. And they are a bit immature. I see them just thinking, overthinking, hesitating, waiting, wanting to take action, but not taking action, not taking charge of the situation. Here it is again, Seven of Pentacles, they are waiting. Just that they have feelings for you, but they are not doing anything. Now let's see, will they take action for the second week of December? Page of Swords in the reverse. So I don't see them taking action, at least for the second week of December. They will just be watching you from afar, from social media, maybe. So they want to talk, but uh, they don't have the courage to talk. And uh, I see them just watching you from afar. Maybe one day they will talk. But at least for the time frame of this reading, I don't see that. Uh, I don't see communication happening in the near future. I will continue this reading in the extended, where I want to view more details about their feelings, how do they view you, what are their intentions, and also the mutual energies and the energies around each one of you. If you want to watch the extended of this video, you can find it now in the description box below. See you in the next reading, and bye for now.